What's up everybody? Welcome back to Scars and Whiskey for our next review. Today's review is The Witch Doctor, uh, which was made by AJ Fernandez and is available on JR Cigars. I do want to give a shout out to Robin Ruslow, who has a YouTube page and was the guy who gave me the cigar to try. So thanks again, Robin, for the, the good looking stick. This is a 6x58. This is a Gordo. Uh, the wrapper is Sumatran, and the binder and filler are both Nicaraguan. It is a Nicaraguan cigar, of course. Uh, it is a box pressed, for those who haven't seen. There, a yeah, good looking stick. It's spongy to the touch. It does look like a double cap. And for a little bit of those who don't know, A.J. Fernandez is a third generation tobacco grower. Uh, and he knows his cigars. So if you haven't had any of the AJ cigars, suggest you try this one. He's got a couple other ones he's came out with. One of the most new recent cigars that I'm a big fan of is the New World. If you haven't had that, he actually did that in collaboration with his father Ishmael, who is a retired tobacco grower, but kind of pulled him out of retirement and said, hey, I need your help. So they created that cigar. So with that said, we're gonna get into this cigar. We are getting the, the, the earth get sweet hay earthy tones a little bit of cocoa not very much but it is a real uh, toothy wrapper not so much oily sheen on it as we would think but man it's a good looking stick so let's go ahead and cut it up and get into the pre-draw now I use a straight cutter uh, to cut the cigar. I know some people always ask, well, what's the difference? You can punch the cigar if it's a larger gauge like this. You can also do a V-cut. It all depends on your preference. Uh, the cut does sometimes uh, change the profiles, but not so dramatic that I would, uh, you know, pick one over the other. I've tried them all, different versions, just to see, and again, that's your preference. It's got a good draw. There's no uh, no tightness to the wrapper. Real, real loose, but not so loose that you draw in so much air that you know it's going to burn quick. Uh, but I said, like I said, it is a good looking dark uh, Ecuadorian Sumatran wrapper. Um, that's all I can say, it's really good. So let's go ahead and light it up and we'll get to that first third. Getting good smoke off the cigar. Again, it has a lot to do with the way the draw is. Getting a little bit of sweet cocoa right off the bat. And um, very interesting start. This is the first one I've ever had of the Witch Doctor. So uh, if you're looking for the cigar, I know it is available on JR's cigars.com. Now if you buy this, there's a box of 10 available on JR's for about $60. So a really good price point for five cigars. Um, a little more uh, pricey if that's not what you're liking, but you know, ten cigars for sixty bucks—that's not—that's not a bad deal at all for a, a good cigar, especially something that AJ Fernandez has been involved with. So, getting a little of the sweet hay on the retro hell as it comes back through the nasal cavity, getting a little bit of leather, and uh, we'll keep going at the first third I'll be right back all right we're back after just a few minutes of the first third getting into it I get a little bit of the burnt coffee flavor not too bad as you can see the burn is not razor sharp but that's okay a lot of times they correct themselves so we'll see how that goes and I'll let you know uh, but so far a really good cigar and like I said for the price point it's a really decent budget so if you're looking for something to try and uh, you haven't had the Witch Doctor, I suggest try it and give your opinion of it. And always, you know, leave me comments about the cigars if you think there's something I missed or something you want to see in the in the future videos. But so far, so good. We'll be back with our second third. Welcome back, everybody, for the second third review of the Witch Doctor. Uh, an exclusive uh, private label for JR Cigars by AJ Fernandez. In the second third, we're getting a little more of the um, the cedar profile. 
a little more of a dark chocolate profile. Uh, we're get, picking up a little bit on the spice, uh, like a black pepper profile. Uh, the burn's not so razor sharp, but that's okay. So far it's not hindering our experience with the cigar, but the construction is holding up finale, uh, it's holding up really well, and I do apologize for that a little bit of a hiccup, but man, I gotta say, this is a cigar I would pair uh, with a rum, a uh, dark spiced rum preferably, um, you could probably pair it up with a great bourbon, or even a, uh, a whiskey or a mixed drink of some kind. It just, it, it would be enhanced, I believe, by those flavors. I haven't tried it, might be a review I'll do down the road, uh, but so far, second third is great. And uh, stay tuned, we'll be back with our final third. Welcome back everybody for the final third of our Witch Doctor, uh, AJ Fernandez conglomeration uh, select blend, uh, private blend for JR Cigars. Uh, so far, it is a fabulous stick. So if you're looking for something that is a uh, Ecuadorian Sumatran Oscuro wrapper, then this is definitely the place to get it. In the final third, we're getting a little bit of leather. Yeah. A little more of the bur uh, bitter coffee, more of an espresso. It's a medium to full cigar strength-wise. And man, I gotta say, it's a good stick. And uh, so pick it up, try it. If you like this video, please hit like and subscribe. Always leave your comments. Thanks again for tuning in Cigars Whiskey. Have a great day. Have a great smoke. I'll see you next time. Mm -hmm.